I'm Damien Delangeron. And I'm Rebecca Jane. And welcome, welcome to, to Nelson, Nelson Mandela's Mandela event. event. Hi, I'm Tony Peluso, co-founder of Connectedy. Hi, I'm Kate Healy. Ella Hall. Sarah Jackson. And I'm Peter Edinburgh, the other co-founder of Connectedy. Let's find out, please, about what do you do tonight and what brought you here? Yeah, we flew all the way from Boston to support Nelson Mandela's dying wish of building a children's hospital in South Africa. And we're doing that by supporting with the Legacy of Hope bracelet, which we designed at Connected with specific colors that are unique to um, certain attributes that uh, Mr. Mandela has. Because each, each bead has special meaning um, that is very uh, specific to uh, the values that Mandela held. Uh, the blue represents uh, voice and speaking the truth. The brown bead represents responsibility, obligation, uh, and belonging. The white bead represents uh, pureness, fairness, equality, and impartiality. Impartiality, thank you. And the black bead stands for discipline, strength, and willpower. But Marvin, what brought you here tonight besides my invitation? How do you feel about the event? Well, obviously, somebody like Nelson Mandela that's done so many wonderful and magnanimous things. It's brought races, creeds, and colors, and religions together in such an amazing, amazing way. And to be able to honor his memory in something like this is just a fabulous occasion. And hopefully, it brings out the spirit and it brings out the opportunity for people to realize how important it is to perpetuate his life. What brought you tonight? What's going on, like unique and special in your heart that you hear? Well, Nelson uh, Mandela was a great man, and he told me about the event. And uh, I called my friend uh, Michael Rosen. And we were a big part of the Riverdale community for many years, and uh, we thought we should be here. Um, we love the charity aspect of the hospital being built, and it's very exciting to be involved. Thank you for coming so much. Michael, the Thank same you. question to you. What brought you tonight from well, your heart? I, actually, Victorino warned me, but when he said the Nelson Mandela Foundation was involved with this, I felt very strongly about all the work that he's done all the years. That's Thank you so much, guys, for support. Thank you. Keep in touch. We'll, we'll see well. you. Thank you. See you. Take care. Take care. Thank you. Oh, Lorenzo, what brought you here tonight? I'm Prince Lorenzo de Medici and thank you very much uh, to invite me to this event. Si, um, it's a very special for me to support uh, Legacy of Hope because uh, really I have been in Africa and South Africa a long time ago and I understand what does mean uh, to have uh, no opportunity for the health for a lot of children. And Legacy of Hope mission is to finance the dream hospital of Nelson Mandela. So it's a mission that I think uh, all of us, we have to support. We have special friends, supporter and donor for a lot of charity. Patrick Kilpatrick is producer, director, writer and actor. Patrick, we'd like to find all out... All about man, about town. Thank you. We'd like to find out your feelings and what you brought uh, what brought you tonight for this event well what brought me was you actually invited me thank you and i was happy to come out to honor uh, such a great job and uh, i also had never been to this beautiful spot and the annenberg center is fantastic, fantastic. it's an extraordinary party and they're about to raise some money for the foundation and yes. so I'm happy to be here well i have Special friends, Susan here sooner, and I would say Fox News. Mm -hmm. I would say special friends <laughs> and people who support the charity. What's your name? Annie Kyo. And what do you do? I'm a health and wellness expert and author of six raw food books. And I'm Catherine On. My family has a crustacean restaurant in the House and One Restaurant Group. And thank you for inviting us. Yeah, thank you so much. Such an honor to have you. 
What would you say, what brought you tonight? Nelson and Mandela, I mean, he is such a symbol of hope. We call the organization Legacy of Hope, and it's very appropriate for Nelson Mandela when you think about him and what his legacy will be a hundred years from now. Yeah. Thank you. What about you? Amazing. He's just an amazing man, you know, so it's amazing to be honoring him tonight. What about you? What do you feel? What brought you tonight? I mean, he's an incredible man, so we're all here and very happy to be honoring him. Thank you so much. And it's like well, unconditional love. Lyndon Chabak, I would like to find out, please, what brought you tonight. And my friend is Andrew Jensen, a business Hi. partner. That is special day tonight. Can you tell guys, please, what brought you tonight, what your feelings about Nelson Mandela, and what is your maybe projects together? You start with the project, I'll talk about Nelson Mandela. Okay. What about you? Um, what do you it's do? A, Nelson's birthday today, and we, uh, Lyndon and I, um, own an advertising agency together, and we would, uh, we have been wanting to do the advertising in North America for the Legacy of Hope and raise money to um, help build hospitals for children. Um, you said it very well about the advertising we do is cause related and... Well, it, it's... Um, Can you do full links? <laughs> it's elevating humanity and no one could represent that better than Nelson Mandela. And so the kind of work that we do is for cause-related uh, charities that feed children that are starving. And if you think about any representative of the human race that uh, that is self-sacrificing and giving of themselves uh, for a cause, uh, Nelson Mandela is probably the pinnacle of that. What brought you tonight, Victoria? Well, it's Mandela Day, and you've got to sort of support Mandela, because He's like my grandfather. I kind of adopted him without him even realizing. So I just wanted to come out today and support this wonderful event. And what spiritual message can you can you share? Can you feel? Can you send to people tonight? Well, I just feel like, especially at this time in the world where so many children are suffering, it's just really important that we connect together through our hearts and we protect the little ones as much as we can. And it means that we have to come together as adults and put aside our differences and just love. It's all about love. Thank you so much for Thank coming. You. Much blessings. Let's find out what our friends think about this night. Richard, what brought you tonight? Well, first of all, I, I was, you know, I don't want to say fan of Mandela because that is too, you know, I just say I had the greatest admiration for him. I read his books, I actually have done a drawing, a painting of him at a house which I gave to the Italian council. And he's just a man I admire very much. I've always wondered when he was sitting in a cell, how, what he was doing. Was it meditating or it certainly made him a great, great person. And I'd like to know more about him. Thank you so much for coming. Much pleasure. Thank you. Would you like to share a few words, your feelings about well, this? Well, I have been in southern Africa. I met uh, many people and one of the people showed me uh, collection of Mandela items to really love them. Uh, Gabriela Chu and Christoph Chu. <laughs> and so happy to be here and honored to see you tonight. I would like to find out like spiritually what what brought you tonight besides invitation or Nelson Mandela's how you feel it? Well I think <clears throat> Nelson Mandela was a very great spirit and he brought peace to a lot of men's hearts, and hopefully his legacy will live on and bring peace to our planet, which we need very much. He was a very great man, and I'm so delighted to be here tonight to be able to honor him and remember the great things that he did that we can each incorporate into our own lives and keep his life going forever. Thank you so much. How about you? It's beautiful. Well, for me, anytime we support children, help children that need help, that's what we're here to do. 
You know, we all live in a wonderful world. We're very blessed. So whatever we can do to give back is very important. Find out, guys. What's your name and what brought you here tonight? Hi, I'm Athalia Talbot. And I'm Jeff Talbot. Nice to meet you, guys. Yeah. Nice to meet you as well. Good. And we came courtesy of Bespin Holdings for the technology provider for the event and uh, friends of mine. Thank you so much. Thank you. Enjoy this evening. Thank you for having us. We have special friends. I would like to find out why they here. What you brought tonight and introduce your names to us. Thank you. I'm Kelly King and I serve as the ambassador to Fashion Hope, which is an organization that spreads education and awareness of the human trafficking epidemic. So we're here to support your cause, everything that you guys do. Yes, thank you for having us. <laughs> uh, well, my name is Michael Kaliski and I, uh, I have a company called Good Planet. And we uh, integrate sustainable, healthy, and ethical products and non-profit uh, messaging into major studio films and TV shows I love to, it. Uh, to inspire a global conscious shift to you know, better products. Ellen Hargitay. I would like to ask you, what, what brought you tonight? Well, of course, a tribute to Nelson Mandela. And? And Damien, my friend. Thank you so much. Okay, I'm Jenny Cheng. Jenny Cheng is my friend, supporter of a lot of charities and also attorney. I found your ticket. Thank you so much. What brought you tonight? And please tell me what you feel about this event. Well, I know that you run very grand charities, Dalai Lama type of things, and Nelson Mandela's birthday, you know, one of the few people that binds the people on this planet together, you know, people like Gandhi, uh, creating a better world for everyone, and uh, what better way to celebrate it than here at the, the new Wallace Center here in Beverly Hills. So, uh, when you told me about it, I, I, I wanted to get down here. Thank you a lot. Would, would you like to introduce me? Gilles Amsalem, founder of French Tuesday. What brought you tonight? How, what's, what's your feelings about this event? Uh, I had the chance to be invited by you, so I was very proud to be one of those guests to support and to leverage, if possible, some money to help that foundation that's, and bring more money to Africa and to the legacy of Mandela. What's your name? Mike Loho. Pleasure. My wife Joyce. Let's nice be what you felt to come for this event. Well, it's a great honor being here, obviously. The legacy of uh, Mandela is still present. We actually do a lot in Africa and uh, are very dedicated to doing charity there. I'm the chairman of UNESCO, the Foundation for Education for Children in Need. So uh, I think the need of building a, you know, providing great education and as well building hospitals and uh, uh, and caring for these children is, is uh, utmost importance. Yes, 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 yes. Thank you for coming. Hi, good evening. My name is Dan Jaffe. This is Barbara Hollander and we're with uh, Signature Events and we've had the uh, great fortune to uh, be requested to, for our presence this evening with the uh, Legacy of Hope honoring the uh, birthday of Nelson Mandela. Why are you here and what's going on? What's What's unique on your clothes? What it says? My, on world, your left on a, my world on a plate. This is uh, my name is Kevin. They also call me Shevin, like Chef Kevin. And uh, it's our logo, My World on a Plate, events and catering. My name is Terry Orsford, and I have been working with Eric Gast for decades, um, starting with FM World Charities and now with Legacy of Hope. And it is my absolute honor and pleasure. Stairs down. Okay, what? Okay, look and tell me. Of you taking her picture. Beautiful. Thank you. Great, you guys look so great. 